Hello, Gospelite. My name is Erica Pacey. I'm the lead pastor of our church, and I am so thankful to be able to speak to you here uh, through this video. This is the first of several videos we're going to be putting out over the next few weeks as we navigate our way through the COVID-19 crisis. And my, it has been a crisis. These are uncharted waters for so many of us, and there's been a lot of things that have changed in the last few, few weeks, couple of weeks for sure, and looks like potentially several more weeks. And so we are beginning to just kind of get an idea of how we can just do a great job, a better job of communicating with you, of reaching out to you, of keeping in touch with you. And this is one of those ways. And so uh, you'll hear different pastors throughout the next few weeks sharing devotionals, just encouraging thoughts and testimonies. I am here today to share with you something that we are very excited about, giving us an opportunity to kind of get involved. And the way that I want to do that is begin with a passage of Scripture in Galatians in chapter 6, a familiar passage, verse 2, that says this, Bear one another's burdens, and so fulfill the law of Christ. The Bible is very clear about the fact that you and I, as brothers and sisters in Christ, are to bear one another's burdens. It also says in Galatians chapter 6 and verse 10, so then as we have opportunity, and this is an opportunity without question, let us do good to everyone, and especially to those who are of the household of faith. As a result of this crisis, this coronavirus, we have decided that we needed to come up with some way that we can bear one another's burdens, beginning with the household of faith, but also reaching out into this great community that we love called Hot Springs, Arkansas, and the Garland County area. And so what we've done is we have set up, beginning right now, on our website, gospelite.org, an opportunity, a way that you can do one of two things. First of all, you can share with us that you need some help, and you'd love to have some help in a particular area. Uh, we know that a lot of people have been affected by the COVID-19 virus that don't necessarily have the virus, but their jobs have been affected, their transportation's been affected, uh, their, maybe, maybe, maybe there's a daycare situation, or just a need for someone to help provide a way to get groceries or prescriptions or anything like that. And so if you need help, we want you to know that we, we want to know what that is, especially those who are of the household of gospel light, those who are members of our church, but also those that you may reach out to in your community. And I'm going to give you a way to do that in just a moment. So you go to the website and you would click on the, the, the little button, the box that says, hey, I, I could use some help. I would love to have some help. Follow the instructions and then we will get back with you as soon as possible and try to meet that need. Secondly, there's a place that is kind of bear one another's burdens. It's a way that you can volunteer to help to do that by saying, hey, I would love to help. You'd press that button and you would become a volunteer. Someone who would say, hey, I, I, can, I can help in some particular area. We've got several boxes you can specifically volunteer to help in. And then there's an other box where you can kind of tell us, hey, this is an area that wasn't mentioned on the, on the site, but an area that I can, I can reach out and help in. Uh, of course, everyone can, can also have an opportunity financially maybe to give something so that we can apply that to some of the needs that, that are going to come over on the, the I need some help side of things. So it's very easy to navigate your way through this uh, compassionate outreach that we are starting as of right now. So when you finish listening to this video, what I want you to do is go to gospelite.org and just check it out. Become either one of those two people. I think every one of us can either A, say, hey, I, I need some help, and please be honest, be authentic, be transparent, be real. We need to know. We want to know. There's no use in having a lot of volunteers if we don't have anything to volunteer towards. So please fill out one of those two. You can maybe fill out both of them if you need some help and you feel like you can help. Take some time to do that. Before we move on, I want to give you a couple of illustrations. I received this email yesterday that says, I live in a halfway house on Winona Street. I have two roommates and we're feeling the effects of the pandemic. I'm reaching out to ask help from Gospel Light or for you to point me in the right direction. I'm not from here, so I'm learning my way around Hot Springs. We're looking for some food. Uh, all of us are in the process of getting food stamps. I just need a little help until then. Thanks for being of service. That's a great opportunity. And so what we would do is we would contact a volunteer 
who maybe could bring some food to help that person. We're also going to be setting up a little food bank here at the church. Uh, we'll start that tomorrow where you can drop off canned goods or boxed canned food, uh, non-perishable items, where you can drop those off here and we can deliver those for to meet needs like that. Also, we're going to provide a way for you to copy this off of your computer, kind of in a PDF form, and it basically you can give this to your neighbors in your neighborhood or just put it on their doors or use this as a flyer. It basically says, hey neighbor, in light of everything going on with the coronavirus, I just wanted to reach out to see if there's any way that I could help or serve someone you know or you. I'm part of Gospel Light, and we're working to provide essential food and hygiene products as well as personal help and picking up prescriptions or groceries for anyone in need. Please don't hesitate to reach out to me anytime. It also lets them know that we've moved our worship gatherings to online at gospelite.org. So all of this is going to be online at gospelite.org. So when this video finishes here in just a few seconds, go straight to our website right now and fill that out. One of those two, click on one of those two sides. I would like some help or I would like to help. And we're going to jump on this and church, we're going to get to be the church. We're going to get to bear one another's burdens, beginning with the household of faith and then reaching out to others in the community. Man, I'm excited. I love you, church. There's so much more I'd like to say, but I don't want to take any more of your time. Sunday's going to be great. I'm preparing a very special message for the situation we're in. I'm excited about it. I think it's going to lift everyone's spirits. There's a lot of hurting people right now in our church, losing their jobs. They need our help. They need our our, our, our prayers. We're going to keep you posted. Keep listening to the prayer line. Keep getting those emails. I love you, Gospel Light. Thanks for listening, and I can't wait to see what God's going to do. God bless you.